Okay, folks, I think we are live. Okay, I think we are live here. Make, make sure, if you guys can hear me, okay, let me know, okay? Let me know if you can hear me, the sound. Just make sure we have a, uh, we are, let's see here. We are up in the mountains. Uh, so we are Flagstaff, Arizona. Uh, yeah, let me know, is anybody watching this right now? Have, have you guys ever been to Flagstaff, Arizona? Yeah, let me know in the comment section. Uh, it's about, about four hours away from uh, Tucson. Uh, so Tucson is where I'm live, living. Uh, but it's about four hours from north. Uh, it's about 7,000 foot higher. Okay. So Tucson is about 3,000. Uh, Flax is about 7,000. And then if you go up to the mountain, you're looking about 13 or 14,000. It's pretty high. Uh, so right now in down Tucson, about 110 degree right here about 85 at the moment it's about 85 degree right now as we speak let's see it's about three o'clock on sunday afternoon so i'm going to be here for a while i'm going to be here for next uh, couple of weeks so by the way uh, if you guys go on vacation what do you guys usually bring uh, let's say if you guys are driving somewhere right if you go on vacation for a week what is your coffee gear okay let me know okay, let me know in the comment section as well by the way, if you are brand new to the channel, welcome to live streaming. And then uh, uh, I get to see your comments. So if you have any questions or, you know, comments, let me know. All right. We are, let's see who's there. We got BYB's on this morning, this afternoon. We have a rap was on, Elaine. Juan, you got Dogman as well. Okay. Uh, what mountain is that? Uh, uh, Dogman is the Mount Humphrey. Look it up, okay, Humphrey is about 13,000, 13 or 14, okay, yeah. Uh, do the fact check for me right now, okay, do the fact check for me. All right, do the fact check there. I got James, we have Rose is on as well. Rose from Brazil, that's pretty far away. Phyllis is a shout out to Marshall, okay. You got Rappel, also John is as well, shout out to John, okay. All right, okay, Rosa, Rose. Okay, I think we are, I think we, 12,000, here we go. 12,000, is that 365, 12,365? Yeah, Dogman said 12,000, yeah, it's close to 13,000. Yeah. I mean, anything above <clears throat> 12,000 is pretty respectable, if you ask me, all right is you know anything above 12,000 so i mean if you're in flags just make sure you go up to mount humphrey that's the top of the snowball okay go to the ski resort and uh, i used to do that hike uh one uh, every every summer uh, and i went to school here so i i, I went to school in nau is in flagstaff so yeah anyway it's a it's a nice town that used to be very affordable uh, even though this is the coffee channel but man in 90s okay in 90 80s and 90s the house in downtown flagstaff set back about 80 ninety thousand dollars you know one of those small cottage house but those house right now remind you this is the flagstaff arizona like half a million dollars it's out of control okay, it is out of control okay. i'm gonna big shout out to my buddy and he nice enough to me, nice enough to let me use this uh, his house for the next few weeks. So, I mean, this is a. I'm. I'm. If you guys see me, you know, if you guys following my channel for a long time, so this is my go-to spot. Okay. So I mean, every winter I come up here. That's why I do quite a few live streaming from this location all the time. But uh, this summer, you know, he's n nice enough to let me use that for a few weeks. Uh, it's great. Okay. Let me show you the the back patio hold on so that's the patio out there that's the kitchen okay my son is over there hanging out yeah and they just 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 beautiful just beautiful weather here right now all right let's back to coffee all right so my here's my coffee uh here's my coffee bar setup okay for the uh next uh few weeks next few weeks or so uh it's not simple, okay? It's not simple setup, guys. Uh, so this is what happens when, you know, you make coffee content for a living. 
Did I say living? No, I mean, coffee content is my hobby, okay? I mean, that's my hobby. But, you know, Bravo Vista Express, uh, Pro, I'm sorry, uh, Bravo Vista Pro. I have the Pro set up here. Uh, the reason why I brought Pro instead of Express because it's faster machine, okay? Really fast, you know, put on in the morning, turn it on, matter of what, 10 seconds, you are ready to go, okay? So definitely, again, if you are planning on going somewhere for like more than three, four days, if you have the space for it, if you have a Pro or Express, you know, just bring it, okay? It's not a big deal, right? Just the machine, okay? Uh, don't, don't bring any cups though, all right? Do not bring any cups because that's a waste of space. You might want to break it. The reason why I brought my cups, I mean, just for the videos, that's it, okay? If, if this is my regular vacation, I, I just bring some cups, you know, just, you know, I don't even bring a cup, just use the, you know, hotel cups or whatever, yeah. But I'm planning on staying for a couple of weeks, so brought some, you know, a little nice cup there. What else we got here? Uh, hold on, let me show you guys. Let me flip the camera. I, got, I obviously brought my reg, uh, fellow kettle. My tolly scale as well. So we're gonna do the pour over there, pour over setup. I obviously brought, bring some tools, you know, whatever tools you guys have, uh, tamping mat, uh, extra towers. Obviously, you need a coffee scale. Okay, obviously, you got to bring some scale. Again, you don't have to bring coffee container. You just use out from the back, but I do have space. So, hand grinder for my pour over. So, this is an easy presso. Uh, we're going to do a lot of flare this week, coming week. Let's do the flare. I got some light roast from Say Coffee there. I got my MK drippers. It's beautiful MK set up there. And with some Aurea V3. Uh, even though I don't do sugar anymore, but if I have some friends over, I can serve that. Or some beautiful cups from MK as well. Uh, obviously, I bring tools for the, my flare. Those in cup. And water okay the water in flagstaff is pretty harsh okay uh, I, I just checked the ppm test on it is about 130 okay 130 for the ppm so yeah i mean say it's a little harsh so uh, I, I like to do the filter water and also what else and then i did bring grinder as well okay the grinder is my car so i'm gonna be uh Unboxing that tomorrow morning. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna set it. I'm gonna set it somewhere here. Okay, I'm gonna set it somewhere here. All right. So I'm gonna have my uh, electric grinder. So pretty much, I. You know what? The, the fact is, I mean, this is a nice setup for any homes. Okay, I have to say. I mean, this is again. This is the, just like Tyler says, ridiculous. My vacation setup. You know. Uh, luck. You know. I'm, if you have the space to do it, make sure to take two cars, okay? Uh, I brought my, uh, my wife brought her car and I bring my own car as well so I can fit the, all the coffee stuff, okay? A little overboard, overboard, but you know what, why not, right? Just why not, you know, just enjoy your coffee. Okay, enjoy your coffee there. Okay, hold on a second. The internet connection is not the best here, so hopefully, hopefully we're gonna have some. You guys see me okay? Hold on. Let's see here. You got the happy, happy smoking. This is a Jake. Hey, shout out to Jake from Happy Smoking One Hundred. Uh, Elaine, uh, Rappo say uh, DF sixty four. No, it's not a DF sixty four. I'm on vacation, I'm gonna properly bring my proper grinder, so. Any guesses? Any guesses which grinder I brought from my uh, coffee desk? Yeah, let me know, any guesses? Okay, let's see here. Niche, happy smoking say niche, nope. Not at all, no niche. 
Okay, someone say the F64V. Rapo said calf attack. No, not a calf attack. You know, you, you know MC5. Goodness. John say the F83. Man, getting close. Okay, uh, P64. Okay, optional P64. Yeah, Yoda. Is, yep. Shout out to Yoda. Yoda said P64. P64 is there. The reason why I liked P64, uh, obviously seasoned nicely, and then I've been using, using it for a while. Small form factor. Okay, DF83 is a monster. All right, that is a huge. Uh, and then plus DF uh, P64. I already have the box ready to go. So just pop that thing in, print the box. You're you're good to go there. So I mean, that's uh, P64 has the uh, Meisenberg inside. So, you know, it should be good, okay? Play with my uh, flare coming week. Again, uh, it is overboard. Okay, I have to say it's too much. But, well, you know what? Uh, we're gonna have some fun, okay? We're gonna, have a, we're gonna have some fun this week, coming week. And then we're gonna make some coffee right outside the patio as well. We're gonna, uh, let's do some morning coffee outside too. Maybe pour over in the morning. And the afternoon session, yeah, should be fun. I got plenty of time coming weeks uh, let's make some let's hang out yeah, weather is nice okay weather is really nice in northern Arizona well, let's check the comments from you guys Hold on. okay I did think about okay I actually thought about all right bring my EK 43 okay I, I actually thought about it okay I really thought about bringing my EK-43 because EK-43, you know, fact is uh, I can put down in my back seat <coughs> of my car there <coughs> from the floor, okay? I, mean, I, I do have space for that. I do have space for the my EK-43. So it's going to be sitting on this corner perhaps. But man, I mean that, but again, I mean that is, uh, that is uh, too much. Okay. I don't think this thing uh, handle carry that weight. This is the plywood, so I don't think so. Yeah, I don't think so. But again, I mean, as long as we are in some kind of driving distance, all right. If you go on vacation for you know less than like three to four days, Brista Express or Pro, I think you're gonna be yeah. I think you know do it next time. Okay, if if you haven't done it yet. If you have the space in your car, yeah, bring it. Bring your machine. Only thing you gotta do is the Brista Express. What do you need? You know, obviously temper, okay. Uh, 3D dosing funnel, all right. Maybe some, you know, it doesn't take a lot of space for the puck, sc uh, puck screen there, and that's it. That's all you need, okay. Don't worry about tools, okay. Do not bring your tools, anything else. Uh, bring your favorite cups if you wanted to. Uh, bring your coffee. Just use, you know. I mean, don't waste time on bring this either, okay? Uh, coffee container, coffee canister, all right? Take up space. And just buy the coffee, just, just buy the whole, uh, whole beans, whatever you go on vacation, right? Go to a local coffee shops and buy one of those bags there. Cost you, what, 15 bucks, 15, 20 bucks. And then you're gonna have great coffee for you know three four days and whatever left over take it home yeah and then you're gonna save yourself what i mean i don't know your situation but you know my family my wife drinks it my uh, my kids drink i drink and if you go to coffee shops three four cups you're looking at twenty dollars per per day okay that's we are talking about one cup cup each twenty dollars per day five dollars each and um, that's kind of like going price now see for five days that's hundred dollars that adds up hundred bucks in this case you know you can have your espresso in the morning if you feel like latte in the afternoon you can do that as well make yourself latte yeah that's it americano it's perfect all right that's perfect there Okay. Okay. So hold on a second. Elaine asked me, "Did you bring the?" No, not at all. 
uh, Brisa Express, I just put on it just uh, my trunk, that's it. Uh, put on the trunk there, just set right there. You know, bring the large tower, just cover it. Yeah, done. Yeah, nope, nope. Yeah, very, very simple. By the way, if you're brand new to the channel, uh, welcome to live streaming. Uh, I mean, my channel is not unlike any other live chat. We just, just hang out. Okay, that's all we do here on this channel. Okay, we just hang out, make some coffee. I share with you some, you know, some tips and tricks on how to use Brisa Express. I, last time I checked, I have about 2,100 videos posted. 2,100 videos, all right? So if you got nothing else to do, if you wanna waste some time, if you wanna waste some time, this is a great channel, okay? And we just hang out for a few minutes every morning and afternoon, so. Anyway, so tomorrow morning, okay, let's brew some wonderful cup of coffee. You guys hear this sound? Guess what this sound is? Any guesses? Okay. Any guesses, this sound? This is my rice cooker, all right? I, I brought also rice cooker as well, okay? There's a zero wushi rice cooker. So, so I brought my rice cooker, I have a coffee machine, and also you won't believe what I uh, bring to my vacation as well. I, I bet you cannot guess it, okay? Uh, this is the appliance, okay? I brought ice machines, this portable ice machine as well, okay? Because uh, my wife, Casey, loves ice machine, and uh, uh, we do have an ice, make, uh, ice machine and that refrigerator over there, but uh, it's not the, uh, we've been spoiled, okay? We make our ice from uh, the fir uh, purified water, okay? Reverse osmosis. I mean, so, yeah, well, I, you can say we've been spoiled, but again, the ice machine is pretty small as well. Okay, it's not that big. So uh, pretty much I bring everything but kitchen sink, right? Yeah, so, you know, if you're going somewhere for like, you know, more than 10, 20 days, you know, just bring it, okay? Just bring whatever you can, just make yourself stay comfortable, all right? Kind of like home away from home. Okay, hold on. All right. Yeah, uh, let's see here. Uh, Joe asked me, well, I'm really serious about the ice. Uh, not me, uh, I'm not a big fan of ice, but yeah, my, yeah, my uh, wife does, so yeah, and kid. Yeah, yeah, you do need to take care of that. Yeah, you do need to take care of that. Yeah, Rappo said zero wish rice. Yeah, rice cooker, definitely. Did you drive RV? No, no, it's not RV. I've just drive my, my car. Okay. It's only about four hours away from uh, Tucson to Flagstaff. So yeah, yeah, it's not a bad of drive. It's, it's pretty nice there. Anyway, so tomorrow morning, uh, we're gonna brew some coffee. Yeah, I know someone asked me about the flat white there. Uh, I cannot do dairy anymore, so no more dairy for me, but i try something, you know, maybe I'm gonna make one for my wife, okay? I know she loves flat white, so. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a wonderful afternoon. It's about, we've been talking for like, what, 20 minutes or so? Yeah, let me know, okay? Uh, let me know about the uh, live uh, uh, comment section. Uh, what is your vacation coffee bar setup? Yeah, I'd love to hear from you guys. Because it varies, okay? Some people bring this, uh, don't do this, okay? I mean, this is uh, out of control, all right? This is uh, exceptional. Don't do it. Waste your time and money, all right? But uh, if you just have a Brista Express or a Pro at home, just bring that, okay? Just, you only need just this. And if you wanna do something decent coffee, I know a lot of you out there love espresso. The best espresso machine, okay? comes to portable I, I mean there's only one okay, I have to say there's only one I mean if you want the real deal the high quality espresso flare 58 okay by far this is it okay if anybody say you know elsewhere you know anything else like I mean th this is the only the man, I'm talking about manual machine, right? I'm talking about the manual machine. Truly, you're gonna get the high quality espresso, okay? 
I mean, you can go with like other stuff as well. There's, you know, there's a lot of portable manual machine. Wakako makes pico presser, nano presser, uh, flare makes flare, nano, flex, even pro. But again, if you want the real manual machine to get a really high quality shot, I mean, 58, okay, I, I think, yeah, yeah, let me know, I mean, what do you guys think? You, you guys agree with me or disagree? Yeah, let me know in the comment section as well. And uh, Richard say Flare Classic, yeah, I mean, Flare Classic makes decent espresso, but you can only use about 13 grams, that's it, okay? 13 grams, what are you going to do with that? Do you have to make another shot? At least a 58 uh 58 uh this 58 millimeter port filter you can use what 20 gram shot there 20 gram dosing amount so yeah so you're gonna have more espresso okay uh if you want the rear high quality one high quality espresso uh, you don't have a whole lot of options okay not a whole lot of options there anyway uh i think we are good for today i hope you guys are having a wonderful sunday and the tomorrow is third. I don't know. Is anybody working tomorrow? So if you are living in the U.S., tomorrow, uh, 4th of July is coming up on Tuesday. So a lot of companies, they let you take off tomorrow. Okay. So which means you're going to have a long weekend. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday. So yeah. Um, I know some companies, you have to work on Monday, but I'm not sure. But I know a lot of you are watching from other parts of the world. So are you guys having a wonderful Sunday night? And I'm going to see you guys tomorrow, tomorrow morning.